Friends and family are mourning the loss of a 64-year-old Costa Mesa woman who was struck and killed while walking home from work. Police say the driver who hit the woman drove away without stopping to help. Mary Beth McDade live for us in Costa Mesa tonight with more on how this very popular member of the community is now being remembered. MB. Yes, Rick and Cher, her family and her co-workers held an emotional tribute tonight here in front of the Stater Brothers where she worked for two decades. She was killed right in front of it while crossing the street to a bus stop. And tonight she was remembered for her optimistic outlook on life and for the love of her special needs son. It broke my heart immediately. Patricia Batchelor can't believe that someone could run over and kill her 64-year-old aunt and leave her for dead in the street. Just left her there like a dog. That's the part that hurts the most. Last Wednesday night, her aunt, Linda Leffler, finished her bakery manager shift at a Costa Mesa Stater Brothers, where she worked for 20 years. And then as she crossed right in front of the store to a bus stop on Fairview Road near Baker Street, she was killed by a hit-and-run driver. I was told that uh, she was thrown approximately 60 feet, so he had to be speeding. We're told the deli crash occurred at 9.03 p.m. Her family and her Stater Brothers family released balloons at that same time this Wednesday during a candlelight vigil in front of the store. And I heard Thursday morning of the incident and I couldn't stop crying. Police say they're searching for a light-colored Toyota SUV with front end and windshield damage. Meantime, Leffler's special needs son is beside himself with grief. His family says he's never gone a day in his 36-year life without his mother. He can't even attend that. He, he can't he can't process it and he can't deal with it right now. He's but he sat in the closet. Um, he mainly stays in his bedroom. His family says he's too overcome with sadness to attend the candlelight vigil where his mother was remembered for her sense of humor and her kindness. She would give anybody the shirt off her back. Aww. Just just to help. I mean that was just the type of person she was. Mm. Well, police also tell us that the Toyota they're looking for has a missing Toyota emblem on it. Now, the victim's niece is offering a $5,000 reward for tips to help to lead to the arrest and conviction of this suspect. All you have to do is contact OC Crime Watchers or the Costa Mesa Police Department. 